Oh my goodness, guys. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying Spooktober. I had so many cool zombie theme, Halloween theme decks. And today, we're about to play the strongest deck of all time when it comes to Halloween. Today, we're going to be rising from the underworld. Without further ado, let's unlock the scariest power of the dark world. What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy Sam from Team Sam Rex. When you have the oh. Sunday, my father. Ooh. Let me put a smile. Anyways, today we're going to be unlocking the power of the underworld, Dark Worlds. This deck is absolutely insane. Guys, in December, I believe, we're getting new Dark World support. But let me tell you right now, with the new Dark World support, the deck can consistently, and what I mean consistently, hand loop for five. But what if I told you in Master Duel right now, you can actually hand loop your opponent for five with the current support <gasps> that we already have. Yes, Georgie. Before we get started, guys, your boy is using the holographic edition, you know, Ash from the Underworld playmat. If you guys haven't gotten this yet, honestly, it's been a week since it's out. So I don't know if it's sold out yet. So if it's sold out, um, I love you guys. Thank you so much. You will not survive. Once they're gone, they are gone forever. You'll never, ever see the light of day ever again so guys get your play mats today in the link down below at tx1.com for those of you who got the play mats i love you guys all right guys here we have it this is the dark world deck list that i'm working on with today uh this deck is insane what you're trying to do with this deck is trying to get access to cerulee and also silva you guys don't know what silva's effect is this card is gonna be the creme de la creme alongside with cerulee for this video this card right here it says that if this card is discarded from your hand to the graveyard by your opponent's card effect special on this card and your opponent returns exactly two cards from their hands to the deck this is so good because it will not trigger great artifacts because this card returns cards to the deck. All right, so that's two cards gone. We're going to be utilizing Silva's effect twice because we're going to use Cerulean's effect to basically discard itself, trigger its effect, discard Silva. You know what I'm saying? Activate Silva, summon itself twice, loot four cards on our opponent's hand. And then for the last time, we're going to use Cerulean's effect to discard Graffa. Graffa is going to look at your opponent's hand. If it's a monster, they loop the entire... You basically special that monster to the field. And you basically have free Link Fodder. So Graffa is going to be the last card that we utilize to loop the fifth card out of our opponent's hand. And obviously it's a danger based deck. Dangers are really, really powerful. Combine yourself off with Snow, Brow, Cerulee, Silva, Graffa. You basically have the recipe for disaster, right? Really, really good cards uh, to trigger off when they're discarded, searching, of course, Gates. Gates just helps you draw more cards. You're basically drawing your entire deck at this point to see your Cerulee and also your Silva for consistent hand loop. Point second, you guys already know this deck can easily break boards with Bigfoot. You have cards of Unicorn, Axis Code. You have so many ways to just link summon that going second. Uh, you can easily break boards. And on top of that, Graffa is like one of the best cards to help break boards while going second. What makes my deck unique is the fact that I'm utilizing the Emergence Teleport and the one for one to get access to my Psy Reflector, which helps you get access to Chaotic Ruler alongside with Plague Spirit and Chaotic Ruler. Helps make Baron the Fleur. Chaotic Ruler with Graffa helps make, of course, my Zombie Vampire to help get access to more of my extenders. This deck is absolutely insane. I will showcase you guys how powerful this deck is and how we can handle it for five consistently and how we can also consistently OTK. Guys, this deck is really unique and it's actually one of the most broken decks I've ever created. Time to celebrate Halloween by sending everybody to the Shadow Realm with a five card hand loop with current Dark Worlds. Let's begin. <laughs> Happy Halloween, guys. Happy Monday, guys. Hopefully you guys had a wonderful Halloween. Here we go. We're playing Dark Worlds today and you know what? Dark Worlds, really really fun deck okay guys we are getting new dark world support very very soon and the next structure deck but i'm gonna showcase you guys that you can still hand loop with silva with the current support that we have right now so hopefully don't snipe the snake don't hit the snake please hit the snow We're ending turn, bro. Wow. Way to ruin my Halloween, guys. Desiree. Pot of Desiree. I said that or that. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards in hand. And I have no hand traps. Oh, okay. We're playing against trains, so I'm not worried. I am not worried about trains at all. We are going to destroy this guy. Next turn, we only have one Jackalope. Kind of unfortunate, so we get sniped out of that Jackalope. It kind of sucks, but... Oh, Okay. 2k. Uh, uh, 2k. Libe! Wow. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, that's not game though. That's it! Oh, this guy's gone. Zeus. Oh, true. Come on, please. Snipe, snipe graph out of my hand, please. I beg you. Snipe graph out of my hand. Snipe graph out of my hand. Snipe graph out of my hand. Snipe it. 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 We're, we're going for game, guys. We're going for game. We're going for game. It's Dark World, baby. You be draw danger. Oh! Please, Jack. Look, don't miss. Don't miss. Don't miss. Hit graph. Oh, shit. Okay. Summon Drew Cabra. Oh, I should have summoned. Oh, I should have summoned. Come on, don't, don't snipe, Jack. Please, don't, don't snipe. Yes! Oh, yeah. Okay, well, I want to normal summon Plague. Oh, I should have just summoned a Baron, bro. Five, nine. I have no nine, bro, but here is just scary, bro. If a card is sent from your deck to the graveyard, send the top three card. If this card, face up card is from a battle, leaves the field because your opponent's card effect. Carry one card in your graveyard and add it to your hand. That is broken, bro. I want to mill four. Oh, and I mill Zephyros? Oh, it's over, baby. Yeah, should have stopped it a long time ago. And I'm going to make Abeloza, bro. So, better stop. Yeah, you have to hit this now. You're not going to hit this? You got fat L, bro. You got fat L, man. GG. Good game. Yeah, good luck. Activate gates. Oh my god, this is insane. Banish this. Send Grapha. Draw one. Pop this. Yep. Yep, sir. Yes, sir. Should have stopped it when you can. Grapha pops it. And now we'll use begin of the end. Draw three cards. It's pot of greed. Better than Pot of Greed. One, two. Oh, I gotta banish the Silva, unfortunately. Draw three. Congrats. <laughs> activate Soul Beast. Add a Soul Mode Activate from deck to hand. Okay. And then activate e Telly. Oh, this is oh, this is too much, bro. It's unfair at this point. Uh yep. Summon uh Psy Reflector. Psy Reflector effect activates. Activate Psy Reflector to reveal a Soul Mode Activate. Okay. Uh, we are going to summon Assault Beast. And we're going to increase its level by 3 to make Chaotic Ruler. Oh my god. This is not even over yet. Guys, here we go. Chaotic Ruler. And we're going to mill 5. Mill more cards you mill, the better, to be honest. More cards you mill, the better. The Chaotic Ruler. Activate this. This guy should have killed me last turn, bro. 1. Oh. <gasps> 2. Oh. 3. Oh. 4. Oh. 5. Yes. We're going to add, of course... Uh, the, the snow and we're gonna send the rest of the grave we're gonna draw one off beast beast effect draw one beautiful oh my god oh my god and now on top of that we can just even go zephyros to bounce gates back now we use gates twice summon uh, zephyros okay now we're gonna go activate gates gates and activates effect to banish the silver, unfortunately, so we can't silver hand loop anymore. But we are gonna utilize graph though. Uh, we're gonna send snow to the graveyard. At draw Bigfoot, snow effect at triggers. We are gonna add. We'll get brow. Activate this. I'm gonna banish seven cards. One, two, three. Summon snow. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to simply just go Dugaris. Because Dugara is amazing. This is why Grapha is so powerful. I'm going to showcase you guys why. I'm going to go Dugaris. I'm going to skip our main phase one. Special one monster from the graveyard in defense mode, right? So it attached to. We are going to special summon Snow. And now we are going to use our Grapha to bounce back our goddamn Snow. It should not be allowed. Now we can just activate Danger Nessie. Let's see what we're working with. And it's game. And it's already game. Like we could, we could just keep overextending. Titanic Galaxy, Vampire, uh, Love Vampire Lord, whatever. IP. There's so many different combinations of cards that you can have access to when it comes to this deck right here. It's it, very, very powerful, very strong. All right, guys, here we go. Dark World time, guys. Let's set up an unbreakable board and also try to hand loop our opponent for five. Okay, this hand is not the greatest hand to hand loop for five, but we can make it work. Here we go, guys. Oh my God, no. 
Oh, it's like that. My sensor really. Come on, send a monster, please. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, they can't do my network now, loser. I think it's best to do this first. And then we'll add this. Unfortunately, we don't have any monsters in the grave. Get a monster, that would have been nice. But I know they're not that nice. So banish this and root and this. Draw, okay. That's not bad. Effect. Discard. Silva comes out. No two. Yeah, this is not good. You know what I'm saying? We have to pass turn on this, unfortunately. But uh, we can't get OTK because they have monsters on the field. So we're pretty much Gucci. You know what I'm saying? So let's try to hand loop it next turn. Let's hand loop next turn. All right, OTK. That's all we got to do. Hand loop the OTK. All right, here we go. Four cards left in our hand. Yep. We have to crash it. Yep. Yep. Thank you. Yep. Yes. Do, do the damage for me, baby. Yes, sir. Boom. What did I tell you? Or make, yeah. Probably make Appaloosa or Evermax. Evermax is fine, too, to be honest. I'm cool with Evermax. Okay, send Numero on network. Honestly, thinking about it now, I should put Silva in defense mode, to be honest. Silva in defense. I don't know why this card is in attack mode. While well, I'm going first. Makes absolutely no sense. I think he's going to make Evermax. Oh. Mega Clops, okay. You know I can beat this card, right? I can destroy this card. This is easy to, to, to out. Alright, here we go. Hard destruction. Wow. I'll tell you that. I'm just gonna end my turn. I, I don't know why I left it in attack. Should have left it in defense. It's a rookie mistake. Okay, here we go. We'll activate one for one. Send Sushinoko. This. Activate a salt mode. Activate. In our turn. Oh, this is never gonna end, bro. This is never gonna end, baby. This is never gonna end. Here we go. Did they only play? I swear they only played two Numeron networks anyway, right? Sure. Okay, Regeki, my own. It's fine. Should have waited a couple turns. Beautiful. Let's see what we're working with here. Let's go emerge and teleport. Wow. Baited. Monster reborn. This. And we'll activate this. Show us someone activate. Target level three. Make chaotic ruler. All, all we need is one fiend monster. One fiend monster for the gates of the dark world. Wow. Two, three, oh, four, five. Oh my god. Did this. Banish Cerulee. Send this. Draw one. Wow. This. We're going to search. Search graph was good. Death. Bouncing this. Summon this. Next, I'm gonna activate this. And go with this. Banish snow. Send Grapha. Grapha. Pop this. Now I can normal this. Activate Grapho. Bounce the to my hand. Guys, this is how we beat Numerons, okay? And now we go... Vampire. Activate Zombie Vampire. Attach Grapho. Oh, we'll summon Mothman. Then we'll go Card Destruction. Activate Snow, Chain Link 1. Brow, Chain Link 2. Better have that nib, baby. Activate this. I want to do this. Banish brow. Send this. 
Activate this, draw one. Wow. Wow, beautiful. Beautiful, guys. Lugaris. Activate Bigfoot. Yes. Turn Bigfoot. With Mothman top of my deck. Now, just in case he has Nib. Take Baron. And we'll activate Dugaris. Target Zombie Vampire. Yep, perfect. And I have Baron. That's fine. If he Nibs, it's fine. Beginning of the end. Activate Skull Dread. Summon Silva. Activate Graffa. Bounces back. Summon. Beautiful. Please hit hit Silva. Oh wow. Summon Nessie. Hit Silva, please. Yes. Summon Nessie. This is so beautiful, bro. Silva comes out. Yeah, this is overkill. This will definitely wasn't needed, but it definitely needed to happen. Because it is a Dark World video. And we're going to do it. This ain't a Dark World video if you don't do it. See ya. Rafa. Shadow Pulse to the game. GG. Man, it's, this guy thinks he can sit on a Mega Clops. You think you can sit on Mega Clops? Guys, I haven't hand looped yet. You have to hand loop to win, okay? Remember, guys, remember, our entire goal is trying to hand loop our opponent. Okay, guys, that's hand loop for five on the very first turn with Dark Worlds. Let's begin, guys. Let's go. Yes! Honestly, it's the most beautiful thing in the entire world. Once you hit snow, oh my god. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Okay, guys, we got this. We got this. I believe in the heart of the cards, guys. Here we go. e Tully. Summon Psy Reflector. Here we go, guys. Activate. This is our this is our punk engine without Deer Note, okay, guys? Here we go. Add this to our hand. We have to get Silva and uh, Ceruli. That's it. Once we get access to, uh, to Silva and Ceruli, we win the duel. Activate this effect. Review Assault will activate. Okay. Summon Assault B, so we're going to increase the level to 3. Okay, beautiful. And now we're going to use these two to make Chaotic Ruler. Let's go, baby. Chaotic Ruler. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Mill 5. Yes, mill 5. Come on. 1. Okay. 2. Oof. 3. Okay. 4. Oh, 5. I think Cerule is better, yeah. Because we can go Gates, right? And then Gates can activate its effect. To banish the snow, to discard Ceruli. And then we give our opponent Ceruli. So now they can't imprim us. This column, really important. Ceruli triggers to discard, of course, the Brow. And Brow gets the Pot of Greed effect. Oh, that's beautiful. So now, don't hit Snake. Yes! Okay, activate Jackalope. Uh, we are going to summon. Mothman from the deck as a level four. And now what we're gonna do. Oh, maybe that was a wrong play. Ah, that was a wrong play. Now we have three Mothmans in our hand. Not good. That's fine. I, I it's, it's okay, I guess. Then we can activate Akashi to bounce those back. Yeah, we should it should have been another danger name. That's definitely an, an oopsie on my end. So now we get to hit him. Oh wow! 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 That is wow. Yeah, this hand loop is gonna work now. We're really gonna trigger. We're gonna put, put it to this side again. And then Saru is going to activate. We're going to get, of course, uh, Silva, discard. Okay. And then Silva will trigger to loop, loop two cards on our opponent's hand. It's, it's a mandatory loop two, okay? It's a mandatory loop two. It's a mandatory loop two. We need Grafla in our grave. 
I think Curious. I think Curious effect dumping Graffa is amazing. I think Curious dumping Graffa is good. Now we activate Special and Graffa by bouncing back Silva. Okay, summon this. We have Flag. Now we just play with our hand, to be honest. Okay, now let's go Mothman. Okay, hitting Moth. Activate Mothman effect to draw one, discard one. Wow, that's beautiful, man. Peace. Draw one. Ooh. Our entire goal is to hand loop our opponent, okay, guys? Hand loop. With Dark Roads. Okay, hand loop with Dark Roads is insane. Whoa. That was really good. Wow. Ice Barrier. There's a card called Ice Barrier. Insane. Wow. Wow. Beautiful, guys. I think I'm going to use Plague. I'm going to put Assault Mode to the top of our deck. Turn Plague. Let's go Gates. Activate Gates. Banish this. Send Troop. Oh my god, that's bad. Because I knew I was trying Assault Mode to activate. That was really bad. Summon Mothman. And now this, we make Soryuja. Okay. We need to resolve Skulldred twice. Oh my god. Best situation right now is we activate Skulldred. And then I go... Yeah, we have to hand loop our opponent entire hand. Beautiful. And I drew Zephyrals. Wow. Okay, guys. I, I have to hurry up. Oh my god. I, I have to hurry up. This is going to add really I can be one for one. Okay, no. I special this really for my hand. Rafa. Summon. Rafa. Summon. Guys, 70 seconds left. Can I do it? Uh, Death Rose. Bounce this to hand. Summon Zeph. Activate Gates. Gate effect. Uh, banish this. Discard Ceruli. Activate Ceruli. Uh, summon itself here. And then activate Ceruli. To discard Silva. Silva, loop two. Come on. 58 seconds left. Yep, yep. Come on, come on, come on. Two. Let's just make IP, whatever. Okay. And then we'll special summon Grafa. Bounce his back. Summon Grafa. Got a ruler. Oh my god, guys. I can do it. I can do it. Security Dragon effect. Bounces back. Oh my god. I could have died. I'm rushing, man. Oh no, that's perfect. Yeah, this. Oh, guys, 12 seconds. 12 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, draw two, discard one. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Saruli. Summon, come on. Come on. Silva, Silva. Come on, I do it. Five seconds, five seconds. Come on, come on, five, five, five. Hand loop for five! Let's go! Let's go! Hand loop for five! Let's go! Enter. Oh my god. Oh my god. I literally turned off my toggle. I'm not acting any effect. Let's go! Dark Worlds just hand loop for five without new support. Let's freaking go.